Our children are growing up in a world that most of us could never have imagined. Studies show that there is an across the board decline in the mental well being of our children, and the trend does not seem to be getting any better. The current pandemic and the many issues surrounding it have led to this decline. How do educational institutions address this problem? In the North Country, social emotional learning initiatives have greatly impacted the mental health of our students. This is great, but we need more. Studies show trusted adults in academic settings can greatly improve the behavioral health of students. Student assistance program counselors provide confidential caring support for students' emotional needs. This work is really important. It's important to know that there are resources both within yourself and in your community. Techniques we use here at the regional include uh, mindful movement, which is mindfulness and traditional yoga. We have seminars that we offer during the flex time that uh, rotate in topic based on student need and request. We work with NAMI New Hampshire for youth leader uh, training for peer-to-peer -peer support uh, for suicide prevention. And we make sure student voice is included in any of the major decisions because mattering is something that's important to all of us and having your voice heard is part. All student assistance program counselors in the North Country are trained in Project Success an evidence-based program that gives student assistance program counselors the tools they need to identify, address, and provide solutions to an array of student needs. In high school, I always knew that I wanted to help kids, but I wasn't really sure how I wanted to do that. I had friends and family members who went through addiction and I didn't really know how to help them, what to say, what to do. And now I'm able to help students learn what they can do to help their friends, their family members. I believe that everyone deserves somebody in their corner. And I want to do my part to make schools welcoming, welcoming and supportive. My overall goal as the SAP is to support students regardless of what's going on for them. Knowing who to go to when necessary is really helpful. So that's my main goal is to be someone that the students trust. Through Project Success, student assistance program counselors are trained to help students survive what could potentially be the most difficult and stressful years of their lives. A hundred percent, I do it for the kids. They're all incredible and I want them to be aware of what's out there when they leave for middle high school so that they're able to make healthy choices and live their best lives. I hope that the students I work with are able to communicate with their support systems better. I want each of them to know that they're not alone and help is always available for whatever they may need. When I was growing up, I was involved in youth leadership through adventure. And I've been in that program now for over 10 years. As an SIP here, I hope to grow leaders in all students and help students realize how important prevention is. The health and well-being of our youth is the backbone of a healthy community. Support the Student Assistance Program and the trusted adults that can make a difference.